this video is all about the electrical override of slider 160 or 500. The only way to manually operate the smaller sliders is by connecting to TA dongle and set it to manual override. The dongle has enough power for these smaller actuators to open, close or calibrate. So here we are connecting to our dongle and then we see the TA slider 160 changeover popping up. We can connect to it and you will meet with see the remote control option below. We connect to the slider to check the live screen and we see above that the status is uh, stopped at the moment. We click on remote control and then after a few seconds you will see that the live status will appear again and you get this dongle like image. Now if we click on the auto button which was blinking green it will become red and you see electrical override above that it is enabled. By going back to the live screen we see electrical override so it won't listen to the input signal again. Even when we are reconnecting to the TA slider you will see that the electrical override is still enabled so the TA slider is not reacting to any input signal. This could cause, cause some claims or mistakes on site. So the only way by putting it back in standard operation or in automatic operation again is to click on remote control again and then click on the auto button below. You will see the LED will start blinking green again and then we have our slider calibrating and then it will listen to the input signal. This is similar to what we see on our TA dongle when we are not connecting with high tube. 